Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Mike's World. Today we're going to talk about something extremely important and that is your SD cards, particularly how to keep these from failing, the proper maintenance to ensure that your SD cards last a long time. Just about every camera these days takes an SD card and it, they're notorious for failing and becoming corrupt or you losing your video. And so, but there's some maintenance you can do and there's some tips that I can give you to help you avoid that. I have particularly SD cards that I've had since 2010, that's 12 years, 12 years old that still work perfectly, but there's some things you have to remember, some things you have to do. First and foremost is when you use an SD card in your camera and it comes time to delete video, don't use the format option in the camera to clear off your SD card. Why? Well, what you should do is actually go in, select the clips and delete the clips. What you'll notice is if you, if you do this, one, one thing you'll notice is when you delete actual clips, it takes longer to delete. When you choose the format option, you'll notice the card almost instantly becomes free and empty. But it's actually not empty. And so what happens is, and I'll explain this, is that as you fill up your card and write your video, you see the clips there, you, you see the data, and it's full. And, and if a clip's there, you, you won't overwrite it. And so um, it's, it's somewhat protected, basically. Um, and what happens is, is when you select format in the camera, it basically wipes away the protection but leaves all the data. So the card shows that it's empty, but it's not really empty. All the data is still there. And what happens is, is on a formatted card in your camera, all that data is there. And then as you record new videos, it overwrites that data. But what happens is, is over time, as it's writing, overwriting that data, writing your new videos, little pieces of data sometimes get skipped or overlooked. And that's what we call a fragment. And over time, these little fragments of data build up to a point where they corrupt your card. And so you don't want that to happen because when you get a corrupt card, you lose footage, the card won't read in your laptop, there are all kinds of issues arise, and then what happens is people throw away their SD cards, well, it's not any good, and they go buy new ones, which is what I'm sure the manufacturers want you to do. So what you need to do, but when you delete footage in your camera, actually delete the footage, not just use the format option, you're actually deleting the data as well. However, there is one other thing you need to do. So if you're deleting footage from your camera, then you're prolonging the life of the SD card. But the other thing you need to do is about, if, if you shoot pretty regularly, if you're using your cards pretty often, then what you need to do with these SD cards is about once a month or every two months, you need to put this in your laptop or your computer, and you actually need to do a full-on format of these cards. Now, I'm, I sound like I'm contradicting myself, right? Don't format in the camera, but now format in the laptop. Well, let me explain the difference. Like I said, in formatting in the camera, you're just taking away the protection but leaving the data. When you put the card in your laptop, go find the card or the drive associated with the card, right click, and go to format. Now what's really important here is that you uncheck the quick format box. Now this is going to take a lot more time because what all quick format really is doing is the same thing that the camera was doing. It's eliminating the protection, showing you that the card's empty but really not getting rid of the data. When you do a full format of the card, you are completely wiping everything off that card. It is deleting all that data, it is cleaning that card out and making it essentially like new. So if you use that, if you do this, if you delete footage from your camera and then every once in a while go in and do a full delete of your SD card in your computer, you will prolong the life of your SD cards, you will minimize any chance that you'll run into errors or lose footage. I mean, minus any catastrophe like getting it wet or dropping your camera in the water or something like that. But um, it will prolong the life of your SD cards. They will last a heck of a lot longer, and you're going to be, be happy that you did that. So this is how you can prolong the life of your SD cards. Hey, if you've enjoyed this video, please subscribe to the channel. If you haven't subscribed, like the video. Always leave a comment. Tell me what you think, and uh, we'll see you next time. Take care.